Hello, everybody. Welcome to this presentation. This is Zhu Yundai. Today, I will be presenting our work rethinking query expansion for BERT re-ranking. Today, people are used to type keyword queries into the search engine, such as Google or Bing. Um, however, in fact, behind these short queries, people usually have a much more complicated and specific information need or question in mind. Such as shown in this uh, slides, the query is human generic code, but the actual information need is looking for progress that is being made in the effort to map and sequence the human genetic code, which is much more complicated than that query. Historically, people were trained to write short unnatural queries that we have seen in the search bar because classic search engines relies on back of words retrieval, which ignores the context in the sentence. These type of retrieval models will fail on natural queries or queries where words like where and to matter a lot to the meaning. But recently, we have seen a different trend. Researchers found that with the Deep language models such as BERT, queries written in natural languages now actually perform better than keyword queries. So in this work, we want to expand the keyword queries that people are used to write back into natural language queries so that it can improve a state-of-art BERT-based re-ranker's accuracy. We hypothesize that the difference between a keyword query and a natural language query lies in two parts the grammar structure within the sentence, and the new concepts. This work studies the effect of both factors by investigating various query expansion methods. So we start by adding new concepts to the original keyword query. Here, as shown in the diagram, um, the gray bar shows the performance precision 10 of a keyword query on robust 04 using a bird free ranker. The yellow bar uses a classic query expansion method, RM3, to add new words into the original query. And that new query is used into uh, to the BERT ranker to rank documents. As can be seen here, the uh, classic QE concepts does not improve the original keyword queries. Actually, it hurts the performance. This is because the added concepts are in discrete word format and they do not have any structures of language and they are not suitable for BERT rankers that is trained on natural languages. Next, we investigate the effects of adding pure structures to a, natural, uh, to a keyword query. Here, we try two different methods as shown using the blue bars. The first one uses a neural machine translation translation method to generate a fluent English queries from the initial keyword queries. Um, the other one uses manually defined templates to map a keyword query into a uh, natural language query. Both methods does not add new concepts to the query. Here, as we can see, they cannot outperform the keyword query either. This experiment shows that structure alone is not sufficient for battery rankers either. Finally, we try to add both concepts and structures to the initial keyword query. This is done by using the query suggestion from Google. Um, as shown in the paper, we have an example showing that the Google suggest queries both contains new concepts and are in natural questions formats. Here, the light green bar shows the original Google suggested questions, and the next one shows filtered Google questions. As can be seen here, um, once we filter off-topic concepts, the performance of the suggested queries actually can be better than the initial keyword query. It means that adding concepts and structures do improve the performance, but we have to make sure that no noisy topic are added to the query. So in conclusion, this work studies how adding structures and concepts to a original keyword query can improve Birch re-ranker's accuracy. We found that classic word-based query expansion methods, such as RM3, are not sufficient for Birch re-rankers due to lacking of structure. 
we found that rich concepts and grammar structures are both necessary for a query to work well with BERT. And finally, we found that one challenge in query expansion is to avoid topic shifting by adding um, out of domain concepts into the original query. Thank you for listening.